Would you support any cuts in any forms of Medicare benefits to help address the deficit? And if so, what types of cuts would you support and for who? Um, on, on Medicare, it's interesting. I'm glad I brought up Ron Wyden. Ron Wyden uh, has, has teamed up with Paul Ryan on, on Medicare. And one of the ideas that I think is worthy of consideration, I'd like to hear from, from people on it, is, is give seniors additional options. I think that Medicare needs to be there for those who have paid into it all, all these years. I think the same thing that I said uh, previously to you, uh, Garrett, on the, uh, as far as Social Security, the same should apply on, on for those who, who uh, the means testing or, or the income uh, approach. If somebody doesn't need it, doesn't want it, there's no reason we ought to be uh, spent using that benefit for those who are you know, millionaires and so forth who don't want it, don't need it, have it covered uh, elsewhere. Uh, one of the key things that has to be done in, in Medicare that I would think would get bipartisan support is the fact that, and this is from the Government Accountability Office, is that there's, there's uh, at least $50 billion a year that is wasted on fraudulent claims and improper claims and all the rest. And, and that's one thing that everyone ought to agree on that ought to be done and use that money uh, for, for Medicare as well.